you need to stop beating around the bush. When it comes to manifestation, when it comes to getting the things that you desire, you need to understand this, right? You need to decide now that you are already perfect. You need to decide now that you already are the person that you want to be. You have to make that decision now because all that exists is the present moment. And in every single moment, we are making the decision to be something, right? You are making the decision to be perfect. You're making the decision to be whole. You're making the decision to either have or not have your desire in every single fucking moment. So I ask you right now, who are you choosing to be? Are you choosing to be the individual that already has what it is that he or she desires? Are you choosing to be the individual that already is seeing and experiencing success in all the areas and endeavors of their life? Or are you like that person that's always like, but, 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 yeah, but, 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 but what about this? But what about that? Or but this, get rid of the fucking buts, right? No buts. You either have it or you don't. Or but no. No fucking more buts. You either have your desire or you don't have it. Make the decision today and from this moment going forward that you are only going to speak to yourself mentally and with the perspective and consciousness of the individual that already has what it is that they want to experience. You need to understand this when it comes to manifestation. You need to understand this when it comes to the law of assumption, right? You need to understand that if you aren't doing the things that you want to do now, if you aren't adopting the mentality of the individual that already has his or her desires, you're going to experience the results of someone that doesn't have their desires. But when you develop the consciousness, when you develop the frame of mind of the individual that already has these things, that already is that person, the unfolding occurs. And you then start to experience things of that like nature. You start to experience things that are in accordance with that mentality. You start to experience things that are in accordance with the perspective of the individual that is living from that place in their own mind, in their own reality, right? Your consciousness is very sensitive. And what I mean sensitive is that you think, okay, well, I'm doing my techniques, I'm doing my affirmations, I'm doing my visualizations, but that means I can just entertain bullshit all fucking day. Right? I can be like, oh, is it happening? Is it working? I can do this. I can do... No. It is going to reflect to you whatever you're entertaining in here. Right? You can't be half-assed with this. You have to make the decision and stick with the decision that you are now that person. You have to identify yourself differently. Right? You can't... Right? You can't run like a cheater if you've identified yourself as a fucking turtle. Right? So what are you identifying yourself as? Make the decision now to identify yourself as something different. And when you do that, you start to then experience the results of someone that is in accordance with that individuality that you desire to be. But you first have to identify yourself as that individual. If you can't do that, you will struggle. Right? You can't be a square and a fucking triangle at the same time. The mold doesn't fit. You have to decide now who are you choosing to be and adopt that mentality. Once you've done that, it becomes way easier. Once you've decided that you're now this, it becomes easier, right? So identify yourself correctly. Who are you being now? Your job is not to concern yourself with how the manifestation occurs, occurs right? The manifestation is done the moment you decide it is done, right? If you start looking for signs or how, well, then you've adopted the identity of the individual that doesn't have their thing. So you're going to experience the exact likeness of what you're entertaining, right? You must decide now who you have been and don't concern yourself with how it's been expressed. Trust that the moment you claim yourself to be it, the unfolding is already happening or has happened, right? You have to look at it in that way. You have to claim yourself to be what it is you want and not waver. Understand that it's not your job to figure out how it makes itself seen. Notice how I said it not makes itself seen, not how it makes itself known. It's already known, right? 
Your only job is to understand that. Not to, not, you're not meant to concern yourself with how it's going to make itself seen, right? Notice how I'm saying make yourself seen because it's already done, right? You could be wanting that amount of money. No, it is done now. Oh, but you check your bank account, it's not there yet. Oh, they're just working through it with the, you know, the, the banks figuring out how to, how to fucking get your money to, right? That's the sort of mentality you have to adopt. Just because you don't see it in the way that you think you would see it, if it worked, doesn't mean it's not unfolding. And you have to have that mentality of like, nah, it's already, it's already sorted itself out. It's happening now. And you must persist in doing that. You must persist in being who it is that you desire to be now, the next minute, 10 minutes from now, an hour from now, tomorrow, a month from now, right? Until it becomes natural for you. Do you understand? It's that simple, guys. It's really that fucking simple. You can't serve two masters. You can't be two things of opposite nature at the same time, right? Problem is, most of us have, got, have gotten used to being something for so long that it actually feels uncomfortable to identify ourselves with something different. And that uncomfortable feeling deters, deters a lot of us because you think, well, if it feels uncomfortable, then I must be doing something wrong. When in reality, it's just you simply shedding your skin like a snake. You're simply shedding that old version of yourself and your new self is kind of wanting to emerge, but it feels so unnatural to you that you have to adopt a new mentality, right? It feels unnatural to wear this new skin. Persist in it. Persist in doing that till it becomes natural. Persist in, in doing it until it becomes normal for you. Yeah. And once it's normal, it becomes easier and easier and easier that you almost don't have to think about it anymore. You almost have to stop thinking about it because it's so natural for you to keep doing this now. You've adopted this new personality. You've adopted this new mentality, this new identity. It's become simpler and easier that you almost don't have to think about it anymore. But at first, it might be difficult. At first, it's going to require you to have awareness, to have discipline. Because the old you is going to want to creep in. The old you is going to want to knock on that door and say, well, yeah, but remember, this is who we are. No. No fucking slap the fuck out of that and say, no, that's not who I am anymore. This is who I am. This is who I'm deciding to be. And you have dominion over that. You have the ability to choose to be that person now and tell that old version of you, sit the fuck down. You're no longer being that. You no longer identify with that individual. You are now this. You are now whole. You are now perfect. You are now the person that has whatever it is that you desire. Yeah. If you want more help, go to the link in my description and, um, I'll offer, co I'll offer coaching for you guys there, okay? It's been your boy. Peace, power, prosperity, and love always.